Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today is Thursday and it marks the two week anniversary of when I broke my pelvis in five spots. It's been two weeks you guys, two weeks and I'm doing fabulous. I had my first physio appointment today and basically she just went over um, exercises that I can be doing to keep my muscles, you know, exercise while I recuperate. She said with pelvic fractures, the biggest thing is rest, rest, rest. Let everything heal up. That's all I, that's all you can do is heal. You can just heal. So um, I talked to her about the fact that I left the house yesterday and she said, yes, good for you. She said, it's all good. Gave me a couple of tips. Like I should get a cane to do the stairs. And so, yeah, I'm doing, getting a cane to use the stairs. She's making me grow tea. Yeah. So just Sophie and I are home today because Gabby, where did Gabby go? To Kaylee's. Gabby slept at Kaylee's last night because today they have um, a horseback riding lesson and I'm going, I'm going to see Stella, you guys. And like, I have to ride. Yeah. Why do you hate riding now? Do you hate riding now? No. Do you want to ride? So why do you say it like you it's hate it? I want lessons. Oh, you don't want lessons? Why? Well, I don't want as much lessons. Oh, why? Because they push you? Yeah. Yeah. She's she's nervous. She she feels she wants to ride. She loves her horse. She loves horses, but she feels nervous now. She feels nervous to do things that are out of her comfort zone because it seems scary to her. And it's going to be a while, you guys gonna be a while before she gets back to herself because you guys might not know this but when I fell there was a time when our instructor had to run to the other room to get her phone and in the meantime I was laying on the ground screaming and crying and Sophie was there just Sophie and she was so close to me and she was looking at me and she just kept saying I can't see this I can't see this and she was breaking down like she did not know what to do to help me and she felt like she was the only one there and she had to help me and there was nothing she could do and so I was laying on the ground and I was screaming and I was trying to get away from the pain I was rolling trying to roll around at one point I tried to stand up to get away from the pain and I was so mindful of the fact that she was breaking down like she was like this close to a nervous breakdown and she just kept saying I can't see this and and I kept on like I, I would be like screaming help please help me and then I would see her face and I would say Sophie I'm okay I just I make these sounds because it helps me get the pain out and then I'd be like help please help it hurts so bad and I would just be screaming and then I would see her face again and then I would be like Sophie it's okay I'm okay I'm totally fine Sophie it's okay I just need to do this this is how I always make myself feel better and I yeah like all that it's gonna take time like I think she's got a mental block there about anything like she saw me in that state when our trainer asked me to do something that was new and difficult me pushing myself that's what happened and now she's scared she's got like a block and it's just gonna take time but she does it she goes there and she does it and yeah, it's gonna all happen. It's all gonna work out. And I think that, um, you know, having Stella at our barn is gonna really help her to do a lot on the ground and a lot of playing and a lot of connecting. And I think that's gonna really help a lot too. So guys, all the, I'm sitting on my mom's chair. All of a sudden I see Ruby just pounce on the floor and grab something. And I'm like, what is that? And then I take it from her and it's her toy ball. And it's this ball, which she, Totally destroys them. I'll show you how she loves them. Ruby. She loves them so much. Uh-oh. We're at the barn, you guys. It's exactly 14 days since I've been at this barn. 14 days. Longest I've ever been away. Good reason, though. And I'm excited to see Stella. Like, 14 days, she probably forgot me. She probably, like... You guys don't understand how much of a bond I have with her, how much I love her, how much I want her to just be safe and happy. I just, I want it to be summer. I want it just to be at our own barn. I want to just have time to love her. Sophia already left without me. <laughs> She's, she wants Stella for herself still. <laughs> Let, her, let me see her for a second. Hi, Stella. Oh my gosh, I could cry. 
I need to stand up and see her. Oh, Stella! Oh, I love it. That's like the perfect color for him. I love it. Merry Christmas, Kaylee. Merry Christmas. What'd you get? I got a red bottle. Can we see it? Okay. Yeah, he looks gorgeous. That's a good color for him. He's like, come on, my feet have been, my foot has been hurting me for so long. Can't you fix it? Farrier's coming today. I love it. That's the color I like. I like that even better than the, than the really bright red. I love it. And a quarter sheet. Oh, did you get a quarter sheet? What color was it? Just black. I love black. That's nice. Yeah, it goes with everything. Though. Yeah, like, that's so true. Blue, it wouldn't go with everything. Yeah, that's I mean, nice. Make him look half clean while yeah. it's on. Yeah, that's amazing. Oh, you look so good. I'm just definitely pulling it out. Yeah, that's weird. That is so weird. Like, look, she's like not even looking at me. She's like, I know, I know what happened. It's okay. I, think I feel sad. She started walking away from me in the field. Maybe she's afraid of my wheelchair. Stella. Stella. Do you like the light blue on her? What do you guys think? I didn't just take a handful of her blue. Oh my god, why is that happening? I don't understand. Like, oh my god. It's like it's spring for her. She's just pouring hair. She looks weird. Stella, I missed you. I missed you. I missed you, pretty girl. I feel like she doesn't know me, you guys. This is your own hair. I got eat it. I love your sweater, though, with your jacket. It's so cute. She looks different. You look different to me. She's like, really? Really? This is what happens. Christmas happens, and then I get to have to wear all this stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> look at Storm. Storm's like, I look so stupid. <laughs> like, you know how the Beauty and the Beast says that? <laughs> Stella's grumpy. Are you grumpy? She does not like the ear I love it. That's a good color for him. Look how cute. Yeah, of course you can. I really like that rope, too. So our barn had all these things here for photo shoots. But yeah, so they're, they don't love it. Just say they don't love it. Making a Christmas memory. How pretty. She's got her new hoodie. And a purple sweater and a purple jacket. It looks so good together. Oh, her camera does not want to open. Stella's uh, just so relaxed. Yeah, she likes getting her feet done. No. And he said that her oh, feet was... are good so we can keep the shoes off. Although it was so scary when we were walking in because he was sweeping. Oh, so she was spooky? Scary. Yeah, well, when we move, we'll just spook her. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, I spend my time running around, keeping people pleased. But this is my favorite holiday. It's a chance to start over new. You know, it's so weird. Everybody left. It was just me and Storm here, and Storm started freaking out. And then the minute Gabby walked by, you could see him visibly go and relax. Like he put his head down. That's him pawing. Yeah, he doesn't want to wait. He's impatient. He's an impatient horse. Storm gets bored. So this is what happens. When you have a bored pony, you need a girl that can entertain him. Because I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me. Stella's talking to you. Yeah, yeah she's. Mom, I want to do she's snorting. She's snorting. She wants to do something. She doesn't want to just go back in the field. She wants to do stuff. 
Where's all your friends though? They're all gone. There you go, Stella. Oh, your friends are calling you. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close. Forget about everything else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Yeah, you might not need this first. He's like, You are not taking this first off. No, she needs to get good at spurs. Mm -hmm. And he needs to, you need to wear them on a day when he is forward so he realizes that you don't have to use them all the time. Okay. Yeah, he's like raring to go. Like, look at, like, like, mm -hmm. have you ever seen him move that fast? Just like walking around on his own? No. No. When he, he was. He's like, ow, that was your spur in my gut. <laughs> I have no idea what the heck she's doing up there. Trying to fix her stirrups. Oh. They were Sophie's length. Oh. She I didn't think... adjust them before she and got And Storm won't stand still? No. Wow. That's the energetic Storm when he sits in the stall. Right now we're ready to try. Like he's still going, Gabby. He's still walking. Like this horse usually, whoa. Oh, that though, what the heck? Is that, is that fast for him? It's beautiful. He's like, Merry Christmas! It's I'm a forward horse! Beautiful. This is the difference between Storm with no shoes feeling bad and Storm getting new shoes feeling good. Mm-hmm. They're getting there. Oh, well I'm not even controlling Turn that. your toe in a little bit. So your spur doesn't sit on his belly when your legs are staying still. That's better. Now squeeze with your calf, not your heel. When you asked him to trot, he said no? He almost bucked. Oh, he, almost... he almost bucked. He's shaking his head and flicking his tail, but he's not actually going to pick a speed up. Squeeze him with your calves, not your heels. What'd you call it? Happy? Happy hops. Happy hops. He's not going to actually buck. I he won't put his head between his knees and actually buck. He'll just hop. Working trot down the center line. Are you going to cold anymore? Middle and center line change, you're rising and you're going to go the other way. How straight can you go? How straight can you go? Move, move to the right. There you go. Oh, you like your fantasy. I know this can't be real. I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling way down. All delusional. You got the feeling like, like I'm lucid dreaming. Got the flying high. Cause I can't believe that I can't. So just like you came up, we're going to 
survive. I'm freezing. I'm ready to go home. It was a good lesson though. Girls had good, such a good lesson. Even Sophie had a really good lesson. But um, this is Gabby's new bucket. Yeah, does not hold all her stuff. <laughs> or at least it doesn't appear to. Maybe this stuff could go in the bottom. Also, Norm's new blanket that we bought three weeks ago, toast, finished. So we were lucky and able to get this Bucus blanket. Bucus blanket? Uh, somebody posted it on our barn website that they were selling it for 20 bucks. And I was like, oh, that's the first one. I was like, me, me, pick me, sell it to me. So anyway, that's gonna go on him today. And then we're gonna go and get him another one at the tax store, um, probably in this week, because yeah, he needs another one. I will ask three weeks our instructor thinks is that um he just kind of stands there and when other horses like play at him he doesn't move out of the way instead of like running off because he's so slow and lazy he just stands there and then that's how it's happening but yeah it's like definitely tricky it is late we're finished riding but we're so back here again we're back here again why are we back we're back because we bought storm a new blanket that could get wrecked but anyways, bought him a new blanket, and we forgot to put on his bell boots. So he's gonna be all nice and colorful, and <laughs> you're just so curious. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite They were getting the bell boots on, they're filthy And Storm is just too curious with the camera you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you And there you have it we're done for the day. Goodbye, Storm. Bye, Storm. Good night. Good night, guys. We will see you tomorrow. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.